Susan, today we are hitting abs, chest, thighs. Nice little circuit. We're going to do three circuits, three exercises per circuit, 60 seconds of work, 30 seconds rest. We're gonna go right into our warm up. Here we go. We're gonna start with jumping jacks and begin. Nice and high. Arms up, legs jumping, warming up, getting that heart rate going. Woo! All right. How are we doing back there? Doing good. All right. And we're going to go into butt kicks in about right now. Kicking those heels up to the butt, moving those arms. Heart rate's probably starting to get up there a little bit more. Warming up. Nice. Good, you guys. That's it. Next, we're going to be hitting lateral hops in about three, two, one, and go. Here we go. Keep those feet together. Nice, good lateral bounding. Warm up the ankles. Getting that heart rate up. Whew. Nice. Good. All right. Next, we're going into rotational jacks. We're going to go rotate to the side. Good. Clap in the front. Face is going to follow where you're clapping. Nice rotation through the back. All right, 20 seconds. Good. Nice stretch to the chest. All right. Woo. Opening that chest, last set of rotational jacks. We're going to be moving into walk out to cow. Nice straight leg. Walking out, hitting that hamstring. We're dipping down, looking up towards the ceiling, pushing back through our shoulders. Walking back up is one. Here we go again. Walking out, dip down. Nice look at the ceiling, pressing back up. Good. One more time. Walking out, dipping down, pressing up. Good. Everybody feel like you're getting into a nice stretch? Great. All right, here we go. Into the circuit, we're going to do a plie triple squat. You're going to grab your Dumbbell, one, two, three, up. One, two, three, up. Next, we're gonna go into a tra traditional push-up. Plank, dropping down, back up. We're gonna stay on the floor, onto the side, hands behind your head, feet on the ground. We're just using those obliques, 30 seconds on each side. All right, you guys. Woo, ready to go? Feeling the energy. Off we go, 60 seconds work. Feet are gonna be out, and here we go. One, two, three, up. One, two, three, and up. That's it. Nice little pulse, hitting those thighs. Little rotation in those feet. If you're here, I just wanna see a little rotation out there, back there. Excellent. And three. Anybody burning yet, or how you doing? Yeah. Oh yeah. These are good. All right. A little more than halfway there, everybody. Keep breathing. Nice, good energy. Think about keeping your head and shoulders up. You don't want to see anybody leaning forward, back through your heels. This is great for building that backside. Bikini weather is always a good incentive to work out the back. All right, five, four, three, two, one. Excellent job, you guys. 30 seconds rest. Kind of stretch those legs out a little bit. Maybe grab, pull up. Get a little stretch through those legs. Next, we're gonna move into working the chest. Little break for the leg, that's always nice. Okay, nice, good breathing. Doing good. Everybody's still looking a little fresh, I like that. Five seconds, you guys, we're gonna drop down. Traditional push-up. If you need to hit your knees, that's okay. Here we go. Dropping down. <sighs> nice straight back. Core is nice and tight. Don't wanna see that back slumbering down. Nice and straight. Also think about when you're pushing down, really think about engaging that back. Really pulling, pushing back through your back. Don't make your shoulders do all the work. And up, and up. 
Okay, you, how's, how's my team doing back there? Yeah, awesome. Whew. Doing it. <laughs> Good, we're about 30 seconds out. Oh, less than that. Great job, you guys. That's it. Nice. Good form. Perfect. That's it. Nice straight body. See that nice, nice flat back? That's exactly what we're looking for. Great job, you guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Well deserved rest. <laughs> Great job. Stretch it out. Let those shoulders relax. Whew. Next, we're going to be moving into a little bit of a core. Give everything else a little bit of a rest that we've been working. All right. Hopefully, everybody's pushing along. Write down your reps. It's great to go and look back on those workouts down the road. All right, here, here we go, you guys. Five seconds out, we're going to go into side crunches. We're down on the ground. Pounds are behind our head, feet are on the ground. Here we go. 30 seconds each side. Really think about engaging that oblique, really pulling your body up off the ground. I want to see some sunlight underneath there. Nice, good breathing. 30 seconds. Doing great. And five, four, and last one. Now we're going to rotate to the opposite side. All right, just crunching up. Really pulling with that oblique. Think about pulling from the side, not from the front, the side. So you're pulling off, really getting that oblique activated and working. Good, breathe through it. Excellent, almost there. 10 seconds out. Five, four, three, two, one and done. Great job. Whew. Excellent. Good job, you guys. Yeah. Great job out there. That was our first circuit. We're going to get ready for a second. Get stretched out a little bit. Next thing we're going to go into is a lateral leg touch. So what we're going to do is we're going to put the dumbbells off to the side. We're just going to tap each leg. 30 seconds that side. Rotate. 30 seconds that side. Next, we're going to go into a chest press. All right, we're going to get on the ground, grab our dumbbells. He's going to have his elbows onto the ground. He's just going to press right up to the ceiling. Nice chest press. Knees are going to be bent. Next, we're going to go into side V-ups. Get on the mat. We're going to start on our side. Rotate. Once again, we're hitting those obliques. 30 seconds each side. We're going to rotate on those. All right, you guys, here we go. Let's grab those dumbbells. OK, we're going to go into those lateral leg lifts. Ready, and begin. I'm gonna tap, tap. Nice little bend. Head's gonna be up, shoulders straight. Core is gonna keep us nice and stabilized. Keep that back flat. Just tapping and tapping. Whatever speed you wanna go, add a little speed to it. All right, how's it going back there? Woo! All right, you guys, keep moving. Keep the energy. That's it. And three, two, one, we're going to rotate to the other leg, and we're kicking it up. Excellent. These are going to start burning. We're really hitting the quads right now. Back of the legs, front, every part of the legs, getting a great little workout. A little bit of oblique, too. It's nice. All right. Let's breathe through it, you guys. Doing really good. All right. Keep counting it down. And five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Time. Take a little break here. All right, next we're going to go into the chest press. Grab, if you want to grab a little bit heavier weight than what you had with the laterals, that's good. Whew. Let's get that heart rate down. Prepare our bodies to do a little bit of, little bit of lifting with this one. Add a little resistance. Okay. All right, everybody at home, here we go. Get those weights ready. Knees are going to be bent, ready. Elbows on the ground and begin. 60 seconds. Good. That's it. It's bringing those elbows down every time, really using that chest to pull those dumbbells together. Excellent, great form. That's it. Nice flat back on the ground. Nice, good. Whatever pace you want to use with, with this, it's great. If you're 
Working with a little heavier weight, that's great. But And if, you, if you're going a little bit less reps, that's okay. Just building a little bit more muscle with more resistance. Whew, great job, you guys. More than halfway through. That's it, nice, good pace. All right, everybody at home, that's right. Just keep pushing it out, pushing it out. Think about using that chest. That's all, that's all it's about right now. Just pushing through with that chest. All right, we're about 10 seconds out. And five, four, three, two, one. Rest, great, drop those dumbbells. Great job, excellent. How are you feeling? Good. Yeah. A little yeah. pump to the chest. Woo, nice. Yeah. All right, you guys. I'm gonna hit those obliques again. So get up, get some air if you want to. We're gonna be hitting the ground again, but if you need to kind of get up, just get your head about you. Stretch it out. Okay. All right, here we go. We're gonna start on our side. Hand is gonna be out. Once again, we're really gonna use those obliques, hitting it hard. And here we go, 30 seconds, reaching for the toe. You're gonna raise up a little bit on this elbow. It's gonna help you do a little bit of the work. Reach for those toes. Really hitting those obliques. Really working those today. All right, you guys, that's it. How's that burn going back there? How you doing? Hey, man. Woo! Five, four, three, two, one. Let's rotate, we're gonna hit that other side. 30 more seconds. Here we go. Same thing, reaching for those toes, using those obliques. Shouldn't really be feeling too much from the front. It's all pulling from the side here. All right, you guys. I know these get rough. Obliques can be actually be a pretty weak place for a lot of people. So this is an, an awesome exercise to keep in. Five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Whoo! Two down, one to go. All righty. Stretch it out. We might be feeling a little tight through those sides, so let's get everything ready to move into our final circuit here. All right, we're going to be going into star planks. We're going to be down on the elbow. Hands are going to be straight. Reaching out, touching the leg. All right, next we're going to go into alternating leg flies, a little bend in the arm, alternating legs as you bring the dumbbells together. Perfect, great. Triple crunch, we're gonna drop to the ground. Feet are flat, we're counting three and lower. One, two, three, and lower. All right, that's our next circuit. Ready? All right, we're gonna hit star planks. We're down on the ground, 30 seconds on each side. Side plank up on our elbow, and we're going. Reaching for the toe. Boy, these obliques are taking a working today. Just reaching, crunching in, really, really crunch in. Make, make it do it, make it really work, you guys. You're gonna feel this through your legs, so we're actually hitting a little bit of the thighs with, with this move, too. And four, three, two, one, and we're gonna rotate. Excellent, okay, here we go. Back up in that side plank, arms straight, legs straight, reaching. That's it. Keep a nice steady pace. Breathe through it, I know it gets tough. You guys are doing great. Okay, team, how's it going? Hey. Someone report. <laughs> Woo, it gets quiet good. back there. Three, two, one, rest. Ooh, yeah. Woo. Yeah. It's amazing how those hit the sides of your legs. They weren't kidding when they said this was gonna be a thigh um, workout. Really, really feeling that. Anybody else feel that nice? Woo, right here. All right, let's catch our breath, everybody. At home, grab some water. If you're starting to feel a little dehydrated, keep that water going. Next, we're gonna go into that's alternating. Uh, we're gonna go right into that alternating chest fly grabbing some weights. If you want to go a little heavier, a little lighter, it's totally up to you. All right, ready, 60 seconds, and begin. Straight leg, alternating kick, slight bend. Want to see a slight bend, you guys? Protect those elbows. Once again, we're really using that chest. Excellent. What else are you feeling working here? 
abs. Legs, abs. Everything. Yep, so nice compound movement. We're really incorporating everything that this workout is about. Legs, abs, chest, full body movement right here. This is a great one. Keep it up if you're feeling tired. Breathe through it, you guys can do it. You're more than halfway there. Great job. That's it. Keep that movement. I know it's getting tough. Good, excellent, you guys are doing great. All righty, we're almost to the end. Push it out, push it out. Five, four, three, two, one. Put your weights down, really relax. Great, excellent job, you guys. Feeling it through the chest, That's core, cool. legs. Woo. If there's any move that I recommend keeping in any of your workouts, this is one that is amazing. I would absolutely keep this in your workout. Write those reps down, track those improvements. Progression, progression, progression. I can't stress it enough, you guys. Keep, keep with it. All right, next we're gonna go into that triple crunch. We're down on the ground. Hands behind the head. It's a three count up and all the way back to the ground. Blowing out at the top. That helps really get a good crunch at the top. Two, three, now we're really hitting the front of the core. We've been hitting the obliques on the side. Now we're really hitting the front. I want to see those backs up and off the ground. Two, three. One, two, three. Don't pull on your neck though. All of the work, all of the movement going forward is coming from that core pull. Good job, you guys. We're halfway there. And three. One, two, three. And one, two, three. How's that breathing? How's that core? What's happening, team? What's happening at home? How's everyone doing? I want to hear some noise. Woo! Yeah. Excellent. And five, four, three, two, one, and rest. Great job, you guys. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Really nice work today. Excellent, excellent. Full body, wonderful. Next, you guys, we're down on the back on the ground. We're gonna keep hitting that core. We're just gonna fire it off here. We're gonna go 60 seconds, elbow plank hold. Ready and begin. Once again, we're protecting that lower back by keeping that core nice and tight, but you're still breathing. The key to this is continue to breathe. <laughs> I cannot stress that enough. <sighs> nice, good breathing. 30 seconds into this, I really wanna hear those good power breaths keeping you Keeping you going here. That's it. Your body is gonna be screaming, I can't do it, but mind over matter, you can do it. Good, nice, good breathing. All right, you guys. We're more than halfway there. Through the trembling, through the body saying, I wanna drop to the ground. Just tell yourself, I can do this, I can make this. It's only 60 seconds. 10 seconds out, and five, four, three, two, one, and drop. Good job, you guys, okay. We're staying on the ground. All right, we're gonna go into 30 seconds, isometric, isometric hold into the Superman. We're back on our stomachs, ready, and we're gonna raise and hold. Great for strength, strengthening your lower back. Nice, good breathing. Just really think about pulling back with your shoulders, your back. Think about keeping those legs up nice and high. And five, four, three, two, one, and relax. All right, you guys, that's it. That is our circuit. Woo! Nice, really good. All right, now I'm seeing some sweat. That's what I wanted to see. Hopefully everybody at home is toweling off too. I wanna see a little sweat going today. Okay, we're gonna go into a nice good warm down. We wanna get that heart rate down. Here we go. We're going into, we're just gonna do a little hamstring pull. That's it. Nice stretch right here through the quad. Now we're gonna bring the leg to the front. We're gonna sit, we're really gonna hit the backs. Back of the leg here. Get a nice stretch, really let that just settle in. 
Stretch it out, you guys. Excellent, here we go. We're standing, we're doing the same with the opposite leg. Nice pull, head and shoulders up. Really feeling that nice pull through the quad. Whew. Still getting that heart rate down. Excellent, we're going back into that nice little seated chair here. Really relax that muscle, let that, let that hamstring and quad really stretch out. Nice, good. Whew. Okay. So next we're gonna go into a stretch. We're going to reach for the toes. Good, we're just gonna come back up to the ceiling. Really stretching. We're coming back to the toes. Did a lot of leg work today. Really make sure you get a good stretch of those hamstrings. And we're coming back up. And one more, we're just gonna go back up. And we're gonna stretch all the way back down. Really stretching out everything we used today. Did a lot of leg work today. Really get a nice stretch, really relax into it. Good, and we're back up. Nice, good breath. Great, thanks for working out with us today. We'll see you guys next time. What's up, V-Fitters? Let me know what you think about level two of the V-Fit in a 30 Extreme Challenge. Upload a video response, hit the like button, or leave a comment below. Remember, there are three 30-day extreme program levels available, one, two, and three. Check out the complete workout plan description below. See you next time for the next day of the BFIT and 30 Extreme Challenge.